Hello, this is Justin Showers, the principal broker here at Home Basics Real Estate. We've got an amazing home to feature today here in Mapleton. It is such a big home. I have to back way into the street just to get it all. It's got this classic look to it with those dormers up top. Big driveway. There's actually two additional spaces, parking spaces, RV parking there. And um, I hope you'll also ask us for the photo tour of this home because the plantings are second to none. In the summertime, this place is alive. It's in bloom. There's so many varieties of flowers and other plantings. So uh, ask us for the photo tour. Uh, we're coming up to the front here. Uh, they do have one door into the garage. There's actually two man doors. <laughs> one here and one on the other side where the RV parking is. By the way, that is an extra tall, extra wide garage door. You notice there are really no stairs up to the front porch. This is a classic front porch that's usable. I mean, there is a lot of space. And in fact, when we go downstairs, you're gonna see that this is storage all the way under every bit of it. You got some of that classic red brick, those black shutters, a freshly painted white door. It's just a wonderful place to be. Let's step inside. Okay. A couple things that you'll know just right away is the vaulted ceilings in here are incredible. I mean, they must be upwards of 18 feet. And uh, it's a nice wide entryway. Notice the, all the beautiful trim work here. I love these hardwood floors. They are extensive. They're throughout all of your great room here. But before we get there, Let's talk about this formal living room. It's gorgeous. You have the tray ceilings, all that crown molding, all the additional lighting. It looks so great. Plantation shutters. I mean, it's just one of so many upgrades you're gonna see. Even look at the, all that handsome trim work above the windows. They've wrapped every one of the windows in this home. The carpet's in fantastic shape, obviously. Okay, let's move in a little bit further here. And you're just gonna die. I hope that on this video it's coming through just how big these vaults are and how big this room is. And you'll notice that the hardwoods all the way through, they did not define any part of this great room with a flooring choice. You can move rugs here and there. You can expand tables any direction that you need to. Uh, furniture can go in all kinds of different con configurations here. Um, I love the stonework on this fireplace. That handsome mantle, and then with all this additional cabinetry. Oh, so beautiful. And then look at all of the windows that we have. We'll step out there in just a minute. Okay. The kitchen has staggered cabinetry, beautiful crown on top of them, a lot of cabinets, a different tone on your island, solid surface countertops. Of course, we have the double ovens. We have a five burner cooktop there. This looks so great. Now, here's the pantry. It is a very, very large pantry, walk-in pantry. They've just done such a nice job here. And maybe, I hope I can do this home justice because there are so many custom touches like these uh, rolling shelves for all your canned goods. And you see how that comes back in from the pantry. Isn't that something? So I, I, again, you're just gonna have to come see the home, and as you do, please feel free to open up cabinets, etc. So for example, if you're looking for more pantry storage or places for your kitchen appliances, the depth on these cabinets is unreal. Okay, we're gonna come right here. Uh, we have the garage, we're gonna see that from downstairs. I love one of the features of this home is that it has an entrance into the basement from the garage. Here's your well-placed half bathroom. They even put some beautiful trim in this bathroom. Gorgeous pencil sink. Okay, the laundry room, my gosh. This is so great. You have a sink in here. Lots of additional cabinets. View out to the backyard. Oh man, it's so nice, every bit of it. You got so much more to see. I'll try to move a little bit faster. Again, huge dining area. It's not defined by flooring, so you can Expand in every direction. Look at the just the baseboards and the additional treatments that they've done there. It's really something. Okay, you're gonna love this covered patio, Trex decking, low maintenance. Oh, 
again, you're going to see so many plantings around this yard in the summertime. They've just put their heart and soul into it. And as you can see here, we have a ramp into the home, which is uh, awesome. Really great. Plus, we've got some additional spaces, patio spaces. There's your RV parking right there. Oh, man, so nice. I hope you're, you can see how big this, this uh, covered deck is. Gorgeous homes behind you. The way that everybody's yards come together, nobody is really on top of you. It just feels so great back here. Okay. All right. Okay, we've got plenty of storage in this home with linen closets. Every door, every window is wrapped. Oh, this master, you're gonna like this. Okay, that's a king size bed. And look how much space it is that we have on either side of the bed, but also just in front of this bed, plantation shutters. You know, here's a unique feature for you. This has two closets and they're both totally decked out. And these are 10 foot ceilings, by the way. So you have more space than you probably need. Here's the other closet. This one has a window in it. Oh my gosh. You know, this is so ridiculous, but there's actually crown molding in the closet. I think you're getting the theme here. This is just a, a custom home, beautifully done, so well constructed, two by six construction. They've blown in the insulation, so it's not just the things that you can see, it's the things you can't see in this home. All of the extensive cabinetry here. We have a big, big shower right there. Okay, and a big tub, jets. Private commode. That is one heck of a master suite. You'll notice the tray ceilings and the mood lighting that goes all the way around. Ah, oh, it's so pretty. Okay, here's a very unique feature of the home. This is a totally handicap accessible bathroom. And gosh, when I have clients that are looking for this, I can never find something. This is rare. And in fact, a lot of families that need this uh, eventually either have to build themselves or they have to do some serious renovations. So a wheelchair can go right into that bathroom without any problem at all. And then we've got this great bedroom here, vaulted ceilings here. That's a queen size bed for reference. We have a plant shelf here, okay. In fact, I, I, I wanna emphasize something back in the, the kitchen and great room. Uh, this, uh, the, the owner here is an artist and he is just unbelievable. <laughs> See, those look like photos, but those are actually paintings. And he just loves the vaulted ceilings because he can display all of his art. But then they're also avid collectors of all kinds of fun trinkets, antiques, etc. And so you've got all that space up there on the plant shelves. Okay, that's the main floor. Big, big house. Let's go downstairs. Nice, wide stairway here. Okay. We have uh, his uh, art studio actually down here, but it's a bedroom basically. Got some built-in shelves, a big, big closet there. Very nice. Now there is a door right here because there's actually um, a second kitchen down here. And so you could lock this off if you desired to. Okay. You have a beautiful bathroom. Lots of charm. Lots of appeal. Three-quarter bath. So great. And then this is, um, well you can just see some of his paintings in here, but this is an enormous bedroom here. They're in the process of cleaning out all of his art. I wish I could have some. It's beautiful stuff. Again, huge walk-in closets. This goes back into that bathroom. That's a nice feature. All right, here's your second kitchen. Nice naughty all the cabinets. Cool built-in shelving, nice built-in desk. And again, I think that room for the you know two freezers, just two refrigerators, but actually one of those spaces is supposed to be for a stove. A lot of width in this hallway right here, and then check out this family room. Holy moly! It is big. It is very very big. We have some additional storage right here under the stairs. Uh, carpets in fantastic shape. I wanted to highlight something here. They've replaced both of the water heaters in the last few years, which is great. 
They have the mana block plumbing system, which is awesome. They have a nice furnace here. And then in this room is actually a second laundry hookup. Super cool. Okay, this um, family room is so large that if you wanted one extra bedroom, or I guess that would be the, yes, uh, let's see, there'd be the fifth bedroom. One, two, three, four, yeah, fifth bedroom. You could frame that, just a wall right there, and you'd have a nice big bedroom, and you would not at all miss anything from this family room. It is just that big. I hope it's coming through on this video. It's just stunning. Okay, we're almost done. You know, families cannot use enough storage. So this is an entire storage room right here. It's just big. And then as I mentioned, as we were coming through the front door, you've got storage under the front porch. Let's see if I can use the very end here. There you go. Um, I can't even tell you the dimensions on this. Maybe I'm gonna say eight by 22. <laughs> I mean, there's just no lack, right? Now, one of my favorite features, as I mentioned, in the garage is that you have an entrance from the garage to downstairs. And this isn't just a typical garage. First of all, I said that's an extra high, extra, extra tall, extra width door, okay? But you'll notice that there's about five feet on each side of the door. So it is really enormous. Uh, if you had somebody staying with you, they would come through that door and then directly down stairs okay there's the entrance into the uh, rv pad and that's the entrance back into the home you got all this additional loft shelving etc this is the widest stairway by the way if you got to get furniture in and out it'll be an absolute breeze so there's so much uh i'm probably missing on this home to be honest with you but you just got to come see it for yourself so uh please give us a call or the agent to provide this tour to you, and let's get you through. But I hope you've enjoyed that. A fine, fine, classic, timeless home here in Mapleton. Thank you.